The Samba. So. Hi everybody, welcome back. I'm Catherine. For those of you who are new, it's a pleasure to have you. For those who are returning, uh, we are back here with uh, Catherine, our spellcaster, who is currently just a magical adept. Adept? Um, where is it? Here we go. Yeah, is currently just a magical apprentice. Uh, we are learning spells and going through the achievements for that. Um, and uh, yeah, just kind of living our life with that. Um, so this is part two, and I'm gonna just be uh, having her do some of the stuff that we need for studying. Um, real quick, I wanna see if there's any rocks. Um, we're not really tired right now, so it's a really good time to get done any work that that needs um, like the charisma or anything. So our jobs and our studying and whatnot. Five minutes later. All right, so we are back in the magical realm here. Um, we got a lot going on and there's a lot of folks around, so um, I'm trying to make friends with the guy who's in charge of untamed magic in hopes, let's see, what is his name? Morgan, Morgan Ember. Okay, I can remember that. In the hopes that he will eventually teach me what I want to know. Oh, Bass is calling. Donate one simoleon. Okay, yeah, because whatever, who cares? Um, mm -hmm. So we're trying to get him to like us a little bit more, so that way he will teach us more secrets. So uh, I can also use that to my advantage because I still need to do a promote the cause. Um, we uh, so there was a little bit of a skip in my editing, and um, not all of the stuff I thought I was recording got recorded. Hooray! Um, so during that time, we basically got our promotion up, and. Voila! We basically got our promotion up, so um, so that's pretty awesome. So we are um, just learning some magic here. Uh, let's see, looks like we're gonna have a little bit of a hygiene problem if we don't deal with that soon. So, do do do. And the trick you learn from doing a rags to riches is that brushing your teeth is oftentimes better than, uh, than washing your hands. <laughs> Oh, we were going to practice a uh, mood potion. I wonder if we have enough of whatever we need to do that. Oh, let's check our spell book. Okay. Um, here, there has to be an easier way to find it. Alchemy. Nausea. Emotional stability. Obtainium and potato. Okay. Well, it sounds like we're going to need to start getting a garden going. So, lucky for me, that's one of the things that I love to do in Sims the most. I do not like doing it in real life. Um, I am uh, I am a black thumb. I, uh, I do not do well at, at gardening at all. Like, so I was gifted a, uh, a couple plants when I was at work a few, well, before the whole pandemic thing shut everything down. So I was gifted two plants and one was a pumpkin plant and one was a zucchini plant. I planted the one that I thought was a pumpkin because I did all this research on, on how to take care of pumpkins. And, uh, you know, so I'm, I'm, God, she's stinky. Um, so in any case, I am, um, did it work? Congrats on promoting the cause. Cool. Um, so I planted what I thought was the pumpkin plant. I did all the research on pumpkins. I, I studied that. And then I go to look at my pumpkin plant and lo and behold, it has a zucchini on it. And I was like, Oh man, it's not a pumpkin plant after all. And the other one that I thought was the was the zucchini plant. Um, turns out that uh, that that one, uh, which I had left in its little little plastic container, was not doing so hot. I eventually went and bought a second planter box for it, and I have replanted that now. Uh, both of which are doing fine, and I have my second zucchini, but I am shocked about this because the point of the story, as I mentioned before, is that I am no good with plants. I am an abject failure at plant things. So wait, how come there's not a kitchen here? Is there a kitchen here? 
dining room. There's a stove. There's there is a kitchen here. Yeah, I can make food. Tuna casserole. Cool. Oh. Summer's so old now because I didn't turn off the aging. <laughs> All right, well, we're gonna make some food for ourselves, and then uh, let's try, well, I have to get the ingredients, don't I? Yeah, I guess I have to get the ingredients. It makes, it's good though that I go digging around a lot because I can find a lot of minerals then. Cool, all right, so uh, yeah, I think our goal for, for our goal here is going to be to start making some potions and see how that goes. Where I feel like there needs to be a magic skill level, but that's kind of what this is. Hmm. Ooh. Maybe there are things... Maybe there's more plants that are harvestable. Oh, how gorgeous is this? Okay, so I'm just exploring because that's a thing that I like to do. And there is Caster's Alley. Uh, I don't know why I didn't notice this before, but we are absolutely going to go there and see what's going on because this looks amazing. Oh, look, there's more digging things. You guys, oh my gosh, I think I, think I might actually have some stuff because I've been looking for some plants and trying to find those. So that's exciting. Okay. Oh, it didn't have a cool animation. It just snapped. Wait, 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 wait. Come on. You're going the wrong direction. Yeah, 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 go! Oh, oh, yeah! Okay, what do we got going on here? There's a place for potion ingredients. Awesome! What else do we have? Any rocks or any plants? This is such a cute little village. Why can't I live in here? Is that really all there is? It's just a potion shop? Oh, brooms and crystals. Wands, tomes, familiars. Okay, so it's just a mall. It's cute. Okay, let's buy stuff. Ooh. Well, we know we need obtainium, and we're gonna need potatoes, but we're gonna also... Perk purging. Consume this potion to reset all of your spellcaster. Oh, okay. And we gotta get us my sims doll, and a dragon fruit to plant. Ooh, that's expansive. Nope, no planting dragon fruits. Okay, well, that solves that. Um, and we've got an extra potato in here, so that's awesome. I guess we will uh, start searching around for some plants because now we gotta actually get a garden going. Oh boy. <gasps> are these manned by ghosts? You guys, these are all manned by ghosts. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, he looks kind of cool. Yeah! They're all ghosts. That's cool. Oh, I want these little things of powder for, for my home. Oh, what did I get? I don't know, just some sort of time capsule. So we're gonna open. We should probably go home soon. Do we have to work in the morning? Yeah, we gotta go to work, so let's uh let's go home. Alabaster apple. So the brooms are a thousand dollars a pop, so let's skip that for now. Yeah, this place is adorable. Oh, okay. We want a wand, I think. So oh look! Look, tomes. That's awesome. 
wand of astral creation, forged out of moonstones and imbued with the astral vapor. This wand holds the power of a million galaxies. That's intense. Uh, for far more sturdy than the bone and moon. Bone and moon. That didn't work well. But we're going to buy one of those. So just one tome and one of those. Huh. Well, uh, should we get an owl? Magic and knowledge, they have a strong connection to the moon and stoically follow their chosen spellcaster. Hmm. I'm going to have to look and do some research on what the familiars cost because I don't know how to do. Oh, I got two Chaz McFreelys. Lame. Okay, go home, please. I mean, that is one way in which you could do this. All right, we are gonna head home. We're gonna take care of our needs and we're gonna go to work. And um, I think we're gonna cut the video there for today. Um, it has been a ton of fun having you all with me and uh, you guys have an awesome rest of your day, morning, whatever it is. I'll catch you all on the flip side.